Previously on The Potentialists. First time actually going to the bed races. I don't know, there was a couple thousand people at the event. We saw one with a swimming pool. I mean, tires from little tires to big tires. <laughs> Anyone can entertain you, but only we edutain you. With a mixture of fun, learning, and craziness, my team and I travel the world motivating and connecting with people. Get ready to make it happen. The BOA team started their day with a virtual meeting while Bert was still in the hospital. So after five days and four nights, Bert was finally well enough to get out of the hospital. Ooh, she couldn't have parked any further. I'm out of the hospital. Can you believe that? It kind of felt like doctors and everybody were toying with us. because I was there at the hospital and some of them came in and were like, oh, you're not going to be getting out for a while. And some were like, oh, you'll get out tomorrow. So it was like this up and down thing. And then finally when we found out he was getting out, it was literally hours before his birthday party. Surprise. His birthday party was Halloween themed. Even though it was after Halloween, we thought we'd have some fun and dress up in costumes. There are some, some pretty interesting and unique costumes that showed up. I was just kind of a witch slash goblin-y thing. My favorite costumes of the team were probably LJ and Eric, because LJ was a genie and he was pretty awesome. He was funny. Eric had, you know, a fun pun going on of being Hogwarts, so it was cute. Alexa and Serge dressed up like the Adams Family because they were so perfect before, so we had Fester and Morticia. Have a spooktacular day. <laughs> <laughs> This was an unusual birthday party where the birthday person didn't show up because he was very, very sick. Although we had taken Bert out of the hospital to participate, we're gonna be doing a do-over very soon. I don't know, you might be invited. Hey yo, how you doing? Check this out, it's Serge from Bowl World. You better like us. And if you got something to say, leave a comment. And check this out, if you really got the guts, subscribe so I can get back to you so we can make it happen with Bowler World. Feel me?